In this video, I'm going to show you how to add line numbering in Google Docs. So line numbers are useful for a variety of reasons. So maybe you want to count the number of lines that you have in your file, display line numbers for easy referencing, or create a numbered citation or bibliography. Well, unfortunately, there's not a good built-in way to number lines in Google Docs. There are some workaround methods that we can use, but none of them are really perfect. And there is a Chrome extension that we can use that will create line numbers, but the extension has been known to have some technical issues now and then. So there's not a really good way to do this, but I will show you um, the options that we can use. So the first way is just um, setting up line numbers using this numbered list option. So what you would do is you would open up your Google Doc and then um, ideally before you have any text created, um, you would select this numbered list option or you can press the keyboard shortcut, which is control shift and seven, which you can see here. So when I select this numbered list option, um, it creates this number here. And when I write and then I press um, the enter key, it will then um, add a new number. So you can continue and um, number lines this way as you write your text. Now the drawback with this method is that one, it doesn't work if you have pre-existing text in your file. It's not going to work very well. And second, um, if you have enough text that it extends beyond one line, let me just write a few more letters here. You can see um, then this isn't really line numbering anymore. This is just uh, numbering every sentence or every time I press the return key or the enter key. Um, it's numbering that. So you may not have a true line count with this method, but it, it's one of the best built-in options. So the next thing I'm going to show is numbering paragraphs. And for this, um, we use this same thing. It's really just this numbered list option. So if you want to number paragraphs, you can see in this example, I already have uh, several paragraphs in this file. So first, what I'm going to do is I'm going to select all of the data in my file. So you can either press Control and A on your keyboard to select everything, or you can go up to the top here, Edit, Select All. So you want to select everything. And then again, this numbered list option in the toolbar is what you're going to select. And this will number your paragraphs. Now, you will notice that um, there was a space between my paragraphs before and now there is not. So in order to get um, that space back, you would click at the end of one, press the return key or the enter key, and then press it again. And now I have the space back between paragraphs. So if you want to number paragraphs um, and you have them already written in your file, you can use this numbered list option. Now, the uh, Chrome extension. So the, the methods that I covered so far isn't really true line numbering because there's not a built-in way to do that in Google Docs. There is a good Chrome extension that does this and it's called line numbers for Google Docs. So if you wanna use this extension, just um, open up Google or your browser and search for line numbers for Google Docs. And then you want to find the um, the Chrome Web Store um, page for that. And then you would just select Add to Chrome, install it. And after you've installed it, um, you will see the option up here. There'll be a line numbering option here. And when you select that, the, uh, the dialog box will open up um, on your, your screen. You should see it in the middle of your screen. And it will have all of these options for setting line numbers and then you just hit apply after setting your options and that will get you true line numbers. But the issue with the extension is they have technical difficulties sometimes. So right now it's not working. Um, other people are also having the same issue. You can read the recent reviews. Eventually they may fix that so that it works again. Um, but 
as you can see, that's not even that great of an option. So again, unfortunately, there's not a good way to do line numbers in Google Docs, but um, you can create something similar with a numbered list. Or if that Chrome extension ever ends up working again, that is your best option. So that's it for this video. If you have any questions, just let me know in the comments. Thank you for watching the video. If you haven't already, make sure to hit the subscribe button. If you have any questions or content suggestions, just let me know in the comments and I'll try my best to answer everyone.